Well, thank you, ladies. Yeah. <laughs> okay, everybody, I'm going to go ahead and start this meeting because we've got a lot of information that we want to cover and we want to try to be done in time. First and foremost, what we always start our meeting off doing is welcoming all of the new people that have joined our team. And this, um, this week, we've had four people under the TNT leg and um, Kristen's not with us tonight, so I'm not sure who all she has had joined, but um, next week we'll be sure and welcome her new people. So I'd like to give a big shout out to Heather McCoy, Angela Phillips, Karen McGowan, and Gina Spearing. So y'all, welcome. Welcome to our team. We're thrilled that you've joined us. You've joined us at the most amazing time in Plexus. We've got some great products that are just flying off the shelves. And, um, you know, I've been doing this four and a half years, and I got like six new customers this month. So I'm telling y'all, the momentum is there. The products are there. The belief is there. And you guys have joined us at the perfect time. And we are here to help you, guide you, love on you, lift you up carry you over a bridge, whatever we need to do to help you succeed in the business the way you want to succeed. Yeah. Um, okay, first I wanted to talk about something, uh, you know, this week has been, well, this month has just been one of the best months that we've had in a very, very long time. And, um, you know, I know you've seen all the posts about Trila and Kristen and myself making the leaders retreat. And I just want to tell you guys from the bottom of our hearts, thank you, because we cannot do it without y'all. It's hard to do it without y'all and um now we still put in a lot we put in a lot of work i'm not gonna lie to y'all we've really uh we've worked hard because we uh came home from convention and our pants were on fire we just saw the writing on the wall and we saw how exciting this business is and how it's just blowing up in the possibilities so we've been we've been on fire we've been ready with it but i'm telling you that it really 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 makes a huge difference when you have teammates behind you that are also signing new customers and also signing new ambassadors because y'all we can't do it all by ourselves and um we'll talk a little bit later on tonight about accomplishments and how i want you guys to work towards a uh, leaders retreat even if you don't think that you can get it because you never know but um honestly i i, I couldn't be more humble and I know uh, Trila and Kristen feel the same way in our appreciation for your love and your hard work and your allowing us to um, pursue our dreams and going on this journey with us. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, we're working hard for more prizes too. And we promise you, I, I promise you that we are going to go on this leader's retreat and we're going to learn and we're going to share and we are going to work on our leadership ability to come back and not just coach you, but um, guide you in how to do what we're doing so that next year you're on the Leaders Retreat with us. So with that, I'm going to turn it over to Trila because she's got some exciting things to talk about. Trila? Yes, I do, Terry. I'm so excited. There are two things, really three, but two things in particular that I wanted to share tonight. Um, the first is that we are going to do another online party. Um, we have been doing these every month. We did not do one in July um, because corporate was starting to do, or some, not really corporate, but um, some bigger teams were starting to do some live online parties. And so we thought, well, we'll jump piggyback on those. But we kind of did a powwow and decided that we wanted to continue our smaller, more personal, intimate parties. Um, so we're going to have one on Tuesday, the 7th of August from 8.30, starting at 8.30 p.m. Um, Central Time. Now, please understand this. This party is to help you get customers or ambassadors. It is our way of talking to your ambassadors, your potentials, um, for you. All you have to do is, number one, say that you want to be invited so that we will put you on the page. And number two, 
you add your potentials to the page and then remind them about the party. And then if you can be on the party at 8.30 on Tuesday night, great. That's, that's the best situation. But you don't have to be. Like, I know I have a couple of ambassadors that really want to work the business but work during that time. They just write to me and say, hey, Susie Q and Alfredo are going to be on the party. Would you please make sure you answer their questions? And that's what we do. That's what we do. So this is for you. Then when they want to order, they go back to you, not to me and not to Terry, not to Kristen, but to you. This is your, this is what we do to help you build your business. So mark your calendar now. Following this call, I'm going to um, upload the graphic and create the event page. And under the graphic, you need to tell me that you want to be invited, that you want to be a part of this activity to help grow your business. Okay? So it's a back to school online party. Okay. Next. Who remembers the big incentive that we had going in July? Do you remember? We started talking about this at the very beginning of the month. It is Christmas in July. Y'all, we have how many? 12, 13 prizes? 13, 13, 13 prizes that we have given to people. Well, people have won. You, you had to earn it. Remember, you had to earn it by adding new customers, adding new ambassadors. TVs and so forth, being on, participating and so forth. And then we did drawings. And we are super excited to give these out. And guess what we're going to do? Tomorrow, August 1st, starting at 8 a.m. Central Time, we are going to announce a winner and their prize every hour of the day. Every hour. Y'all are going to have to check in to be see if you won and if you won what you won. There are some amazing prizes, including money, big time money. So mm -hmm. make sure you are on a lot tomorrow, okay? Check in and out tomorrow on the team page. And please give kudos and congratulations to those who win prizes. I mean, hey, let's we're all here to, to bump each other up. Um, last, Terry, I totally forgot the last thing. Book club. Oh, thank you. <laughs> That's where I was all night tonight. Okay. I want to do a book club for us. It's been a while since we've done one. I don't remember when we've done it last. And I want to read this book um, called Girl, Wash Your Face. Now, this book was recommended by someone, I think, at convention, at one of the speakers. Um, she mentioned it and said, you just got to read it. And then I've heard some of my other church friends have read it, and they say it is it is a book that every woman should read, especially if you're a mom, that you should read it. Not necessarily in a multi-level marketing company, but just any woman, and especially mothers, should read this book. It's extremely motivating, inspiring. Um, it's definitely going to be a personal development book. So I'm going to put a link on where you can order the book. I mean, y'all know how to Google or get on Amazon or, you know, all that, but it's called Girl, Wash Your Face. And I don't even know who wrote the book yet. I mean, I don't have that information, but I'll try to post a picture of the book and we're going to start the book club in September. Okay. So it's kind of our back to school thing, having a book club and a book study. But I want you to join me. I want you to um, to read. It's it's an easy read, they say, and um, I want you to I want you to join me. So I'm going to give you plenty of time to save up your money to get the book, either download it onto your iPad or your phone or whatever, or actually buy the hard copy. So um, I'm excited, looking forward to that for some personal development. So the author is um, thank you, Trina. The author is Rachel Hollis and. Um, Y'all, I read, I listened, I already listened to the Audible, and I got to tell y'all that um, she just resonated with me in 
one of the things that I, one of the reasons I really want us to do this book is because we all, all, all of us suffer from that. Um, I have to be perfect syndrome and, um, you know, or I'm a bad mom or I'm a bad wife or I'm a bad daughter. Or I didn't do what I should have done. My kids didn't get their snacks, you know, and she just real. And she also talks about failing in business and failing in general and the lies that we tell ourselves. And it just was so uplifting for me. It just kind of, Gave, I kind of just went, oh, I am okay. I am, I am a good mom. I am a good wife. And so I really want us all to read it. And I will be reading it again for a um, backup <laughs> to make sure that I really got her message. Okay, I wanted to talk about two things before I get to um, the close. First of all, y'all, I ordered these really cool cards, okay? And um, I will post the email for the young lady that I bought. But I bought the digital, and you can get it on Etsy. I don't know if y'all can see it really good. But you can just put um, a stick of slim right here. And um, I ordered the digital on Etsy for maybe $10. And then I went to Vistaprint, and I got 100 with an envelope. For like forty dollars, a hundred, and I struggled to upload the graphic and do it. I called VistaPrint, and this young man stayed on the phone with me until it was finished. And so, y'all, listen. I'm just saying that if you um, if you have some money, you should always reinvest part of your paycheck into your business. So with this paycheck, I'm telling y'all, you might want to think about getting something like this because probably two stamps and I'll check to make sure, but probably two stamps would mail this and y'all, and you can, I left mine blank on the back so I can write a note. So anyway, y'all, this is a great marketing tool. Um, I'm also using this. I've been asked to put um, stuff in the gift baskets for the Miss Senior Texas pageant. 25 women so i'm gonna do these in that basket now that's 25 people that um i'll get a slim to okay i wanted to talk for just a second something happened a little while ago and um we kind of talked about this a little bit last week but um i posted and i, I want y'all to use this post because it's start i mean i'm getting lots of hits on it but i posted something about uh, post a picture of your dog and see, let's see if people can guess his name. Well, that's all great. But somebody posted a picture of their dog with their competing product on top of their dog. Well, I'm just telling y'all, if you go to post on somebody's page and you know for a fact that they sell Rodan and Fields, do not post something on their page about Joyam. Do not post a picture. Do not post anything about Joyam. I want this to be the most respectful team ever. And um, it's just in poor taste. So if you know somebody that sells, you know, AdvoCare, you will don't go on their page and post about Plexus. You don't want them coming on your page post, posting about Plexus. So I'm just saying, you know, y'all be respectful. And um, I have to figure out what to do about that. But anyway. Okay. So now I wanted to talk about um, accomplishments. Because I know, um, you know, remember Trela and Chris and I, we've walked in your shoes. We've been where you are. And we've been like, um, well, I want to win that. Well, I want to rank up. Well, I want to, you know, I want to get the prizes. And y'all, a lot of times we didn't. We didn't get the prizes. Um, a lot of times we do get the prizes. But that's, um, you know, you, re, you know, we plant, we plant, we plant, and then we harvest. But what I wanted to talk about was um, accomplishments in general and setting goals and then celebrating when you accomplish those goals or celebrating when you accomplish the littlest thing. Okay, so listen, for me, and I've told this story multiple times, you know, I was scared to death to do team calls. Scared to death, but I was told over and over about this girl at work, Terry, you need to do team calls, you need to do team calls. And finally I said, okay, I'm gonna do a team call. 
and I set it up and I typed the whole thing out. And you know, it's horrible. It was a horrible call. Ask Trina. We were disconnected. There was static. I think there was a storm going on. People couldn't hear. It was horrible. I was, and y'all, I mean, I was pitted out. I was sweating. I was so nervous and I was so upset. But here's the deal I did it. I did it. And it was a huge accomplishment for me. I got through that. And then the next week, it was a little bit easier. And then the next week, it was a little bit easier. Well, now, y'all, you just have the Terry show because now I'm so confident that I can talk forever. But here's my point. You sign your first customer. You get your first customer. Y'all, that's a huge. Yes. That is so, that is so celebrate worthy. Because the first customer is always the hardest. Your first ambassador, y'all, huge accomplishment. So many people are turning silver right now. Y'all, that's monumental. Trela, how long did it take you to go silver? Seven months. Seven months. Okay, so I know that you're going, oh my gosh, they're winning this, they're winning that. And y'all, we, we feel the same way. Honestly, we look at jewels and we think, why aren't we where they are? Why aren't we uh, on that stage? Why aren't we, you know, what am I doing wrong? And so I'm just telling y'all that we feel that we, we feel and we have felt the same way. But here's where you have to turn it around. Every time you accomplish something, you're that much closer to the victory. Mm -hmm. You're that much closer to being gold, senior gold. And, and I'm going to tell y'all, when you rank up to those, it's like, it, it, it's like, I don't, I don't know how to describe it. Well, I, I'll tell you, Saturday, you know, I set a goal. I talked to Trila and I, Kristen, Kristen, and I said, okay, y'all, I honestly believe because there's only 1,200 spots on the ship, I personally think we need to make leaders retreat by the end of the month. Now, I've come to find out that my estimation was way off and not that many people have made it, but that was a goal that we set. We kind of talked about it and we said, okay, well, we're gonna try for that. Well, y'all, Saturday, Saturday morning. I thought I thought it would happen Friday night and it didn't. So Saturday morning, I've got my phone and I'm like, and I'm I've still been doing it because we've still got a little bit of time. And I, I have it pulled up and I'm hitting refresh and I'm watching, watching, watching. And then all of a sudden it was said 903. And y'all, you'd have thought, you'd have thought I turned to Emerald. And I'm running in there, JD's in the bathroom. Get out, get out, get out. And he came out and goes, What's wrong? What's wrong? And I said, Oh my god, I made it. I made and so I just wanted to tell y'all that um, everything that you achieve, every accomplishment is so worthy of a huge celebration because every accomplishment just builds for the next one and the next one and the next one. And, and y'all, I remember like yesterday when uh, Trila turned gold. <laughs> New Year's Eve. JD and I are at a John Legend concert in Oklahoma and it's midnight and we're, I mean, we're at a concert and Trina's message, I did it, I did it. And JD and I are jumping up and down at this John Legend concert. People are thinking we're excited about John Legend. Heck no, we're excited about Trina. <laughs> that's how we are going to feel about all of you. And that's how we feel about y'all when you sign an ambassador. And that's how we feel about you when you get a new customer. And that's how we want you to feel about you. So I really, really, really hope that each and every one of you will take the time tonight and do two things. And, and Trela and I have already done it, and Kristen too. So what we've already done is we have gone through and we wrote, what did I accomplish last month? Write down, what did I accomplish? And y'all listen, it doesn't have to be that I saw new customers. It could be that I, I studied the virtual office. It could be that I shared with a complete stranger on the bus. It can be anything. What did you do? I mean, what, what did you accomplish? If you ranked up, absolutely write that in big letters. If you sold more than you wanted to, that's huge. But y'all listen, if you're not there yet, the little things matter. 
the little things are huge accomplishments. The little things add up to the big things. Mm -hmm. It's a building block. It all adds up. So the other thing that I want you to do, and we're going to post about this, and I'm going to tell you, I want to see your goals. And, um, you know, we kind of went over our goals yesterday, and I had to up the ante on my goals, and I had to up the ante on, on treeless. Because if you sold 300 in personal volume this month, don't you dare wrap 300 down. You are quite capable of selling five. And what happens when you sell 500? You're in the 100 but Yeah, you're in the 25% commission. So I'm telling y'all that the goal setting part of this, I don't want it to scare you. I don't want it to, um, I don't want you to think, oh, this, you know, that's too much like school. Y'all listen, if you want this business, if you want to grow, if you want to grow personally, if you want to grow as a, a human, write down your goals. Because I'm telling you, when you come in here every day and you sit down and you look at that and you go, oh, um, well, it's July the 15th and I'm not anywhere near where I said I would be or wanted to be, at least you'll start trying. And you know what? If you miss the moon, you might land on a star. And that's kind of what's happening. You know, I don't achieve all of my goals. I never achieve all of my goals. If I achieve all of my goals, I under underestimated myself. And, that, and that's something you have to face too. And I think a lot of us underestimate ourselves. And girl, wash your face is going to bring that up. So anyway, I just wanted to tell y'all that while, while we're celebrating and you're seeing other people that are making the cruise, and, and let me go back to the cruise thing too. So I thought that we had to have this by July, by the end of the July, because there's only 1,200 spots. Well, did y'all know that on Friday, we found out that, or Saturday, we were in the top 100 people that have made it. So I'm guessing I'm, I bet you there's still a thousand spots left, 900 to a thousand spots. And what they've done in the past, when they're not showing that people are making it as fast, they will change the, change the prizes, maybe lower it, maybe lower the uh, 900 to 700. You know, you never know what they may do. So you have to continue to shoot for that. And here's the deal too. So let's say you don't make the cruise, but you worked really hard. Well, what happened while you were working really hard? You made money, you got customers, and you were building your team. So that's a win. And you know what? You could probably make enough money to take yourself on your own cruise. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying. So I really want you to work on these. The other thing is, you know, they've made the consistency club different. They've made it different. And a lot of people are prize motivated. And, um, you know, if you didn't get the consistency club in July, you know, it's going to be hard to do August and September. But y'all listen, in October, get after it. Get after it. And you still should continue to work to get it every month because you may make the big one at the end of the year. So don't just give up because you didn't get July. Work, work to get, you know, three or four ambassadors and customers in August and then continue because while you may not qualify for this quarter, if you get the last two and you continue to qualify for the rest of them, you're going to get the big prizes at the end, which is really what you want, you know? So accomplishments, how to eat an elephant one bite at a time. One bite at a time. So post if you're scared. There's your first accomplishment. Post. And post a lot, y'all. And some people say don't post. If you're scared of posting, add people to our support page. I post multiple times a day. They're going to get all the information that they need. Okay? Get on Instagram. Wear a t-shirt. Get you a sticker for your car. Those are huge accomplishments. And then you know what you got to do? You got to celebrate. You got to celebrate, got to celebrate everything and be proud of yourself. And I, I know because Trayla and I have sat in the ditch and wah, wah, why didn't we get this? Why didn't we rake up? Why aren't we blah, blah, blah. And y'all, that's a waste of time.
It's a waste of energy. You take that wham wham energy and you put it into raw, raw. I can do this. I can build a team. I can make money. I can change lives. And then celebrate. Celebrate. Celebrate that you helped somebody. That you made somebody feel better about themselves. That you helped somebody get off a of medication. That you helped somebody pay their electric bill. Celebrate. I'm telling y'all, this life is way too short not to celebrate. And your accomplishments, while you may think are small, they're huge. I'm telling you, they are huge. And they will all add up. They will all add up. Okay, that's all I got for tonight. I'm so excited about tomorrow. And I hope that you are too. Christmas, you will find out, is my all-time favorite, all-time favorite holiday out of all of them all time and um we're going to celebrate every hour on the hour tomorrow i hope that you're paying close attention then we're going to ask you to post your goals and then on tuesday we're going to celebrate individual accomplishments for the month of july and we've got a lot of them okay everybody if you need help i'm listen i'm i'm digging doing one-on-one -on -one trainings so y'all call me Message me, reach out to me. I promise you, I will sit down and train with you till the dogs come home. I'm ready. <laughs> if you need anything, just reach out. Prela's here, Kristen's here. We're here to help y'all. And as always, dream big. Thanks, y'all. Good night. <laughs>